Good morning everybody, I hope you're doing well. It is Sunday, it is 9.39. Pete got up at 7, so I got up at 7.15, showered, got ready, just making some bacon and an egg sandwich. Um, we have the game, Pete's now saying we should leave here by 11.30. Ash has a friend coming over at 11. Um, she wanted someone to curl her hair because she's going to a party, a bridal shower or something today. So Ash said she would do it. Then we're leaving to go to the big game. And I dreamt about this game all night. Sorry about the noise of the fan. This fan's very noisy. Let's give it a... Slow it down a bit. Mm. It's not gonna be quiet, is it? It's a very dull overcast, and it looks like it's trying to rain. The ground is all wet, so it's been spritzing, I think. But anyway. I kept dreaming about this game last night and waking up that we couldn't get parking anywhere and we had to walk. So if I'm not taking my handbag, there's just absolutely no point because if we can't get a seat in the stands, standing for two, two and a half hours, it's going to be a bit of a challenge. I just had the worst spasm of my life in my back upstairs. It was actually took me to closed eyes and Lamar's breathing, that's how bad it was. So probably shouldn't go today, but if I, I'm going, because now I'm ready for this, <laughs> this game. But um, I'm sick of my back making me miss out on things, you know what I mean? And it does, it makes me miss out on a lot. And I'll say, yes, I'm gonna do something and then I can't do it, so I'm going. Tomorrow, Hash and I have the parade. Pete's at work. It's so funny, his his um, company closes for all sorts of things, but not for Columbus Day. Funny, <laughs> not funny. Right. Oh, it's Thanksgiving in Canada tomorrow. Happy Thanksgiving, everyone. By the time you see this, it will be. It's unusual that it's on a Monday, so I'm assuming this is gonna be something stupid coming out of my mouth, that everywhere's closed, because it's Thanksgiving. Oh. Can you tell me what Thanksgiving in Canada is? I could ask Siri, but Siri's been pretty useless lately. Let's give him a chance though, but I need to go make my egg because my bacon's ready. Hey Siri, can you please tell me the history of a Canadian Thanksgiving? My web search turns something up for can you please tell me the history of a Canadian Thanksgiving? Have a look. Well, you've not really given me much. Let's see, Thanksgiving Day is an hour oh, passcode. Thanksgiving Day is an annual Canadian holiday occurring on the second Monday in October, which celebrates the harvest and other blessings of the past year. Okay, thanks. All right, Siri. All right, guys, let me go make my egg <laughs> while my bacon is still hot. Okay guys, I am ready. We, I believe, I believe we will win. Go Husky, sending on the back. You won't see it. There's a Husky and it says, I think it says beat right. Oh, hold on. Oh, Louis in front. There you go. Whatever it says. Probably get my face smashed in at some point today. All right, I'm actually gonna pour my water into that bottle because I prefer this bottle, so. And then Ash is doing a friend's hair and then we're off. It's almost 10 past 11. Pete's back. Ooh, <laughs> she's like, now she's like, get off. <laughs> Do I disgust you? Do I disgust you? I hope not. The Huskies have arrived with a police escort. That's how big this game is. And they're all yelling out the windows. Mario. No. And then Mario ended up getting another goal with the pin.
just like half. Thank you. Uh huh? No, I didn't. They're actually, it's pretty real. No, you're okay. Thank you. <laughs> That's cute. Sorry. Oh. Ah. Ah. Okay, now it's getting warm. Oh, Thanks a lot. Thanks a lot. Thanks a lot. Thanks a lot. Oh, did you hear them? Did you hear them yelling out the window? Let's go. Here they come. Let's see if they come. Right on time. Like good counting. Because they could get it. That poor girl was struggling. She Bad. was. She kept on looking. I'm like, stay in school, honey. <laughs> don't do drugs. <laughs> don't stay in school. Don't do drugs. Everything is $2 and $3. It's nothing. Although I was off. I thought. I'm in your way. I said, you're good. You got room? Now? You're in my way. <laughs> I see it, yeah. I'm putting that hair up with a Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> 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 68. Oh, that uh, oh, in the history of all games played between the oh, and the Rock. Record stands at 43 wins for the Garnets. 42 wins for the Huskies. Oh. Ashley's preschool, yeah, yeah. year and a half. That's where I used to bring her and go to work. And behind that wall over there was my house as a nanny. Yeah. <laughs> Hello everybody, we're back. We're all exhausted, even though Pete has gone right away back to the games. He was going at 5.30, but he decided to go early to catch the 4.30 game. Huskies lost, boo hiss, but I tell you, it is a very volatile crowd yelling at each other and booing and hissing, so and some of the parents I was a bit ashamed of what they were yelling out but that's because I'm old but it's not very sportsmanlike very swearing and nasty really wasn't it Ash anyway we're there we were supporting them we had our husky shirts on with pride our band from PC went in the parade today there was a parade in our town today but we didn't go to that obviously because we went to the game so anyway Ash and I will be at a big parade tomorrow and Paige will be marching with the Taekwondo group, not the band. So you'll see her in a different uniform. And that right now is that, isn't it? This is Ashley's tradition, that's why she took tomorrow off. Pete's working. Next year will be the year. Next year will be the year? Oh yeah, yeah. Next year, I don't know who worked it out, Ashley I think. Was it you who worked it out? That next year Paige is... Paige is a senior and the game is home for them so that's perfect so it'll be a good game to go to we'll have to go join in their Friday night festivities with them when they throw little dolls into the burning fire it's quite dramatic but and Rory what are you gonna do Hello everyone it is nine almost nine going to end the vlog. I just came down and made a cup of tea. Pete's on his way home now. So I uh, came down, unlocked the back door and stuff. Oh, my left ankle is so swollen on the top of my foot. But to go rest it because tomorrow we're going to be on our feet again for about three hours between the parade and then walking around the little area where the parade ends. They have little uh, booths and stuff, mainly food, Italian food and um, and they have some of the kids that go to the dance studio and the 
martial arts, doing some demonstrations and stuff like that. I wonder if Paige will be doing any. She might. Sometimes we stay for it, sometimes we don't because it's later on in the day. And by tomorrow, the st all the standing and sitting on bleachers and different things will be enough for me. I've sat on more bleachers over the last month, I think, than I've sat my whole time here. But uh, they were laughing at me today because I was really getting into the game. I'm understanding some of the rules. And I'm like, no, 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 <laughs> standing up in my seat. Yes, there was a lot of up and down. That's why I'm in a lot of pain tonight because we're sitting down and then everyone in front starts standing up. And even though we were on the top rung of the bleachers, you still had to stand up to see what was going on. Um, but yeah, it is pretty exciting. Now I know why you guys get so excited over f American football. But anyway... I'm going to love and leave you for this evening because I am absolutely shattered. Um, I hope you've all had a brilliant weekend. I hope you've had a wonderful Sunday. Whatever you guys did today, I hope it was a good one. And we will definitely see you tomorrow. Good night.